Welcome back to the last part of this set of tutorials. We are now going to get our project out of Camtasia Studio or out of our editing tool and into a format that we can share, we can put on the web, we can put into iTunes. All right, so um, if I go to the file menu, one thing we have not done, which is uh, we should have done much earlier, is go and say save project as because that is the project file that um, if I didn't get it finished today I could come back and work on it tomorrow or if uh, Camtasia crashed I could come back and open this one up and keep working on it. So I'm going to just go out to the desktop, go into the same folder where all my other stuff is and um, put in the name of this podcast. So I just named episode one and hit save so if I needed to work on this tomorrow, I could open that one back up and my timeline and all my um, clips in my bin would all be there available so that I could keep working on it. Okay, so now that I've got the project saved, we should have done that a lot earlier. Um, actually, Camtasia sort of uh, does some auto-saving for you, so but it's important that we do that overtly. All right, with that done, I'm ready to actually produce this video out as one that I can share. So over here in my task list again, there is a choice here that says produce video. All right, so now I have a bunch of choices um, for what kind of video to produce or what flavor, I guess you should say. So if I go to this drop down setting, you'll see all these different options. Um, now I'm just going to choose this iPod version because that will create a version that is. Um, can be played in iTunes and can be played on the iPod. Okay, so you saw the other choice there um, for the iPhone. So if your main audience is going to be using an iPhone, or that also means an iPod Touch, you might want to set up one for that. I'm just going to say yes to that because it's saying, hey, you're, these are different settings. So say yes. And you can see it's going to produce an MV4 file, which is a QuickTime file. That's going to be just fine. Now it says, well, what do you want to name this? So this is going to be episode one. And where do I want to save it to? I'm going to go ahead and save it um, out to the desktop. Because I want it in the same place where all my other stuff is. Okay, so I just browsed. I'm going to come down here, find the desktop, find the folder where I'm storing all this stuff in, and save it into there. Okay, and I don't need subfolders. I just want to put it straight into that folder. Okay, it's giving me a little review of everything I've asked it to do. That looks fine. Click finish, and off it goes um, rendering this movie. So it's grabbing all those pieces, putting them all, to, all together into one finished product. And so I have one file that I can share instead of all those pieces together. So it's going going. Now um, I'm going to create a couple more tutorials that talk about using Camtasia um, to record your screen because it's also very good if you want to record things that are happening on your screen or you want to create a narrated PowerPoint. It is excellent for that as well. Okay so I think it's about done. Here it comes up. There is the finished version of it ready for me to play. It's giving me a little review of this. Let me just say finish that and I'll minimize this down so you can see. So there's the finished product. It's inside of this folder. Here's everything we've been working on today. Okay, so there's some of, let me just open that up. You can see the, um, the two items called episode one. This first one there that has the cam proj um, file name, that's the project file. So if I watch this through and it didn't quite come out right, I can open up that and edit it and republish it out. Here's the finished one. That's the one that I'm sh going to share. That's what we're seeing right now. And then these other items in here are the other pieces or the other assets that I used as part of this um, finished episode. I can play it to, to make sure it sounds OK and looks OK. All right, so with that, um, Camtasia is a great tool for putting together a, a project um, like this. Um, so, good luck.